Hey, Bill here with Chicote Outdoor Recreation. So, this is a video that uh, I never envisioned ever making. Never. You know I'm a small knife guy. I have my favorite knives, and they're usually very small. Patch knives are what I go for. And I got a new one recently, and I, that, that doesn't happen often. I don't really get something new very often. But I did nothing but process some fatwood with it. And Man, there's nothing like the smell of some good harvested fatwood. And you can see uh, that one came off a good stump in northern Arizona. And that's all I did with this knife so far is process it. Now, this knife is designed by Alan Fouts, and it's designed to be a neck knife. But I'm a man, so I don't wear a neck knife. I'm probably going to, there's an attachment to put it on your belt. That's probably what I'm going to do. But all I did was strap this out on my, my leather belt. That was it. And I want to see if it'll, if it's still sharp enough to take hair. So I'm going to have the camera zoom in here and see if it takes any hair, okay? Holy cow, look at that. Look at that. And all I did was strop that out. Oh, there goes my hair, but now I got a nice little ball spot there. But that's how well the edge is on that. It's a soft Chinese steel, but uh, it, it holds an edge pretty good. And it, boy, you can sharpen it up pretty quick. All I did was strop that on a leather strop. So this is it, this is my new favorite knife. It's designed by Alan Fouts. And I'll tell you what, the difference between this and the other patch knives I have is you get a lot of purchase on this. You know, when you're skin and game, you're gonna get a lot of, boy, there's my airplanes. When you're skin and game, you're gonna get a lot of blood, a lot of tallow, you're gonna, your hands are gonna get slippery. Uh, even a little rabbit, man, your hands are gonna get covered in blood and tallow and they're gonna get slippery. And having that extra purchase, whoever this Alan Fouts guy is, he really came up with a winner here because you get an awesome amount of purchase on this knife. So it's a two by five, you got two inches of blade, overall five inches overall. And I tell you, to get one in your hand, I mean, looking at it, it looks kind of weird, but you get that in your hand, even this little thongy thing on the end, it all adds to it. And you just, I mean, you can feel the stability in that. It is absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to do some more things with it. Stick with me. This ought to get pretty interesting. Oh, and at the end of the video, I'm going to show you that there's four options for this. Four blade options, four carry options. You get a lot of options with this little knife. So stick with me. Okay, so you can see I mounted the belt clip this way to put it on my belt where it'll sit like that. I could have done it scout style too, where the knife would sit like this on your belt. It's an option. Um, just to show you the different blade lengths, that's my typical carry knife. I love that knife. This is the new CRKT. Okay, and you know, you might ask me, hey Bill, what about an urban situation? You know, are these knives good for self-defense? Well, they're not 
theoretically designed for that, but this is the TDI law enforcement. And if you've ever watched any videos on this, you know how dangerous this knife is. If you know where to cut and how fast these can be deployed, you know how dangerous these little knives are. So, does it have an application in an urban setting? Absolutely. It absolutely does. But uh, for just an all-around knife that you're going to use, you know, if you're going on a rabbit hunt or a squirrel hunt, you can't beat this. Look at how thick that is. All these are pretty thick. All the way through the spine. But uh, I'll tell you what, I'm pretty happy with this. I think this... Uh, this Alan Fouts guy, he, uh, he did a good job. So I just wanted to give you that cross section right there. Nice, clean, even cut for a patch knife, too. You can't beat it. safe, stay warm, stay free. I hope you enjoyed looking at this little CRKT from Alan Fouts. It's the Minimalist, and uh, I thought I'd share it with you, my new favorite knife. Like I said, till the next time I see you, you stay safe, stay warm, you keep yourself free.